Good morning and welcome back to my channel. My name is Anissa, aka Love Anissa. And if you are new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you're not, welcome back. So today, we're kind of going to do a day in the life of a stay-at-home wife summer edition. Um, Kind of like a get glam. I don't, I don't even want to call it glam because I'm not a glam person. But, you know, get ready with me to go on date night tonight. Jawan did text me. My husband did text me yesterday and said, um, we're going to go out tomorrow night, which is tonight. So get you a good dress and some heels and you know get ready for date night so i was like okay you know <laughs> he will say that when i just took him out here if you haven't noticed i did have braids i just took him out i'm about to do another style um but because next week we're going out of town um so you guys are going to be coming with me today getting all the necessary items that i need to do my hair and uh probably look for a dress because I don't have a dress to match the only pair of heels that I have. Well, I have two pair of heels, um, but I'm only gonna, I want to wear these pink ones, so I got to find a dress that kind of matches that. Excuse me. And um, as you can see, I'm in my car, my Zion. I missed him. Um, yeah, when I came out the freaking garage, I had a like a bug attack me, so I kind of spilled coffee on my shirt. Uh, but it's fine. You can't really see it. Um, I just have on some leggings and some sandals, you know, a little quick fit for the day. Um, what else? I'm probably going to go to the B-Spot store. I'm probably going to go to, like, Stonecrest area just because I like the Shop of Beauties over there. So, I'm probably going to go over there and then I'll just kind of find something. I hate going to the mall, but I might have to today. Um, but yeah, so come along with me as I get glam for date night tonight. do that i don't know why i did that but hey guys so i am back in the car and i decided to do a little haul for you guys so i'm sitting in the parking lot um so my total was hold on my total for everything was 5601 um this is my receipt so let's get started so i got this hair um, Cuban twist because I'm gonna be doing some uh, like Marley twist is what people call it or Kiki twist kinky twist. I just realized side note I used to get Kiki twist all the time and I always thought it was Kiki twist It's kinky twist this whole time and I was looking I said Kiki twist, you know growing up you just be like that doesn't make any sense Kiki twist. What is Kiki? So then I was like wait a minute <laughs> It's kinky twist, not kiki twist. Okay, but anyways, but yes, that's what I'm be doing. Um, you can kind of see it on there, but mine's gonna be probably this size or smaller because it's only gonna be in the back and now I'm doing a little crisscross method up front. Um, so I got three of those and then I got some 
quick soak off for my nails because I have like three or four that's still on my nails and they won't come off. So I got that and I got the acetone to go with it. And then I just got a pin tail comb. Yeah, pin tail comb. And then I've been looking for these cute little things. Ah, I'm so excited. I'm doing a bun tonight with my little crisscross method. So I'm gonna be putting these in it and it's gonna look so cute. You know, I'm gonna look like I'm Asian, you know, Puerto Rican, no, I'm playing. Um, but yes, I'm gonna be putting these in it and these are so cute. I've been looking for these, so I'm really excited to use those. Then I got me some cheap jewelry. I got this jewelry only because I wanted these earrings right here because they're giving knockoff Chanel. I'm just kidding. <laughs> But yes, they're giving Chanel. Um, then I got just some jam. You know, you need the jam when you're doing your hair, especially if you're doing braids or any type of method. Um, it's just good to have some jam. It's been working forever. So then I just got me some cuticle oil. Probably could have used just some regular oil, but I wanted to be fancy. Um, then I got some Ardell Wispy or Natural uh, lashes that I'm going to actually cut up like I was telling y'all and I'm going to be placing them underneath just like they do individual and I'm going to see how that works. One of my friends put me on to that so I'm going to try it for the first time today. Then I told y'all I was going to be doing my own nails so I got me some nails honey. Now I was going to get the little gel thing that you sit up under but that thing was $32 so I'm probably going to try to go to Walmart and see if Walmart has a cheaper one. I'm looking for like one for like $15. I have one, but I'm not sure if it's gonna like, like cure them. I'm not quite sure if it's gonna cure because it was very cheap. So, or I can just go to like a TJ Maxx or something that's out here, but I'm gonna try Walmart first um, and see what they have. But um, I got these. I tried to not get them too long because I didn't want them that long. I got medium length. So hopefully I'm still going to be able to do my hair. Uh, then I got some rubber bands for my crisscross method. And then I got some eyelash glue. I saw a girl use this on YouTube, so I got it. And I think that was it. Yes, so that was it. So that was my haul from the Beats by Store, Chapel Beauty, um, up here by Turner Hill. If you don't know it, now you do. So we're about to head to Walmart. One of my favorite Walmarts, believe it or not, is actually over here by Stonecrest. Some people may think it's a little ghetto, but I don't really think it's ghetto. I think it's a really good Walmart. And so I'm gonna head over here to see what I can find in the nail section, see if I can find one of those little LV lamps because I'm probably gonna need that if I'm gonna be doing this look and using the gel. So I probably, I should have just ordered it off Amazon, but I don't, I didn't, so. Well, we about to see. So I'll tap back with y'all later. Hey everybody, um, ooh, my shirt is wrinkled. Um, Everyone, so I'm back from Walmart and I didn't get a chance to find the, let me make sure this is too loud. I didn't get a chance to find the little UV light that I need to soak my nails under or put my nails under to dry, but we're gonna try TJ Maxx next. But the little things that I did get from Walmart, stuff that I don't need, but got it anyways. Um, I got a picture frame. Hopefully this one fits our marriage certificate because our marriage certificate has just been sitting like in a drawer. So I'm hoping that this fits it. Then I just got these little toothbrush covers. Um, I love these. These last for three months. I never count the months for some reason. I don't know why, but these last for three months. So I got these. I got two. Well, there's two in a pack. So one for me, one for Juwan. Then I got some Listerine. The Listerine, I like the Listerine with the alcohol because I like I like to feel like my, my teeth are clean. So I want to feel that burning, okay? <laughs> Look, comment down below if you feel the same way. So then I decided to get Colgate. I never gotten Colgate before, okay? I was always a Crest. I grew up with Crest. But Crest has just not been doing it for me, y'all. Has not been doing it. So I'm hoping this does it. I'm hoping this does it. Like, I just like to feel like my, my mouth is clean. Like, my mouth be clean. Of course, I brush my teeth and stuff. But I like to feel like you know, the, that burning, if that makes sense, the minty fresh type of thing. So I did get the Colgate, so I'm gonna try this out. 
and I'm really excited to try it. And it's cheaper. And then I was able to get, cause you know, I got a little coin, just a little bit of coins that I can get my little on brand dove. <laughs> my little on brand dove. I got my little on brand dove. This is my favorite soap, you know? But when I'm like, when I need some body wash and I'm like almost out, I have to use the Equate brand. And I really don't like that brand. But you know, I use it anyways, but you know, I was like, I can spend this $6 got my dove so i'm really excited for that and we are headed oh sorry i thought there's a bug on me cap so we are headed to tj maxx now put that down there oh. so yeah we're headed to tj maxx and i'll tap back with y'all when i get there Hello, so I am back home. Just thought I'd do this little, you know, whatever. But I went to the liquor store, got some lick for tonight. Um, and also, the two things that I did get from TJ Maxx were these uh, microfiber cloths. If you don't know, these are the best things to clean, like, everything with. Your bathroom, anything, and they are washable. Um, so I really, really like these. I had a chance to use one last time, and I really, really like how they got everything clean. I'm still trying to figure out like how I'm gonna really clean them. It's a pack of ten, so I'm thinking about like getting a bucket and like like a small bucket and like filling it with like bleach and disinfect it and just tossing them in there whenever I'm finished. And then, cause I would hate to just wash these as a load. Like I feel like that's wasting water, but we'll see how to wash them. And then I just got myself a planner so I can stay organized. So. We know we always get planners at the beginning of the year and we never use them, but I'm gonna try to use mine, I promise. Um, but yes, and that's everything that I got. I did end up getting me my burger, but I didn't go to Arby's. Um, so right now I'm about to go inside, uh, start my hair. I probably finish my hair within like an hour. It's not gonna take that long because I'm only doing the front. So it shouldn't take that long. And then after my hair, I'm probably gonna do, I'm probably gonna take a shower or something I don't know I might do something because I know if I do my lashes they can't get wet but is that only for I don't know because the, the stuff that I'm using is waterproof so I'm like but then the, the people be like don't get them wet for 24 hours so I'm confused so <laughs> so I might take my shower before I put on my lashes so the next thing after my hair dye I'll probably do is my nails so stay tuned for that hello everyone so i am back home and i have did my hair um it's not done yet and i put these in just to show you how they are made and i'm probably gonna wear these tonight um but i think i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here thank you guys so much for watching if you are new here make sure you subscribe down below like i said in the beginning okay and make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and let me know down below any videos that you would like me to film story times i got a lot of story times so if you would like to hear story time go ahead and put it in or give me a like i don't even let you i won't even make you comment Give me a like, okay? I'm probably gonna do one anyways, but, <laughs> or any routines or anything like that. So guys, thank you guys so much again for watching and tune into the next video. Bye.